Legion Tactical Cutlery. Hold the line! Hey everyone, hey guys, doing Grugs here, Legion Tactical Cutlery. Welcome back, troops, Legionnaires, new recruits, and as always, appreciate you guys and gals taking the time to check out my videos and my channel. And today I'm trying something a little bit new. This company reached out to me. I was a little iffy at first, but you know what? I started asking a couple of content creators what they thought, and they're like, hey, it's coffee. You like coffee? Give it a go. And that's what I'm gonna do. A portable espresso maker. Man, I am, you know, pretty excited now. So but before we get started, what do you guys and gals have in your pocket today? Today I'm carrying my PFAL flipper folder. Check out the review I did it the other day. All right. Veterans and active military, never want to forget you guys and gals. Thank you very much for your service. We really appreciate it. Let me show you how it comes out of the box. This is the box that the Outen Nano comes in. So it would make a really nice gift for anybody. You know, let's open it up. It's got some nice pictures. Uh, if you take a look at their website, they've got a carry case for it. This just came with the unit itself, okay? So as we open it, <clears throat> right off the bat, you notice that they have a couple of different recipes for coffee, in case you don't know. Uh, they have a, like a starter uh, page over here right in front of the box as soon as you open it let me just put this off to the side comes with some instructions okay tips you know instructions tricks etc it's nicely styrofoam foam packed all right so it's nice and, and sturdy so you could use the box to, you know in your travels if you don't go and purchase the you know the extra kit and it comes with a cup all right, this particular model has two options, one for the pods, for example, like this, okay, which is what I prefer. And then they have uh, an area where you could, you know, put coffee grinds in, okay? So pretty cool. And a little measuring cup, which is awesome. And there's instructions on that. Um, a little power cord, okay, and there is specifics on what type of a adapter that this can be charged with. And then you have the actual Outen Nano Coffee Espresso machine itself, all right? This is where the water goes on top right here, all right? And if you take a close look, there is some writing for 50 milliliter, 70 milliliter, and maximum amount of water that can go in here. And that's important because uh, depending on how much water you use, uh, uses up how much of battery there is now uh, This is the top for the water. Okay, close it up right there uh, This is the power button You do have to charge it or make sure that it's fully charged at least that's what the instructions say and um, Yeah, I mean it's a nice little unit it's I guess if you're you know if you don't want to bring a stove or, you know, coffee grinds, etc. You know, this might be something pretty good to put in a backpack, you know. Definitely good for a camper. Obviously, a camper is, is kind of small and, uh, you know, you're minimizing on space. So this is a nice space saver. All you really need is a device to charge this up. So uh, I myself have this unit right here okay that i carry with me when i'm doing videos and i can definitely charge up the uh outen coffee espresso machine with this unit right here it's, it has a type c adapter that it comes with okay and i would just plug it in and charge this up but basically depending on how much water that you use you can get up to five brews with this that's that's not bad you know all right so let's get started let's check it out let's see how this works out this will be my first time making coffee outdoors you know and it's it's i guess for some backpackers this might be too heavy for them but again if you're going to brew coffee then you're going to have to bring uh grinds and uh you know stove and a pot to boil water in which you may already have Again, this is just, I think it's a cool concept and I really wanted to, to try it out for myself. So, and I wanted to show everybody also. I like the espresso pods. The espresso pods are just easy and uh, they're lightweight. So it would be perfect in your backpack. So what we do now is we 
we take off the the cup and we open this up okay and you can see that's where the water is going to come out from so what i'll do now is i will pop in this pod and you just have to make sure that the pod is in there nice and firm okay all right so that there's no space there's no gap it'll go back in here into this well and then you screw it back on nice and tight okay put it in the cup now since this is pretty strong espresso i'm just going to use the 50 milliliter option and as I'm pouring the spring water right up to the 50 milliliter line right there. All right. With that water down. We are going to put the top. And then when you turn on the power, you will see that there's four lights that pop up. You hold it for a couple of seconds. And she will start brewing. So it'll heat up the water and then pour out from the bottom. The water is heating up right now. I just wanted to open this up and show you guys. I could see the bubbling starting to happen. Put the top back on so it gets nice and hot. You just heard a beep and now you're hearing a sound and the espresso is starting to pour into the cup. How cool is that? Now it does take a little while to heat up. You press the button for about two seconds. The water heats up for a good, I don't know, 30 seconds or so. And there you have it. All right, this is very cool some espresso right here this is awesome all right let me just put this down there you go espresso now you add your favorite sugar okay i wish i had some sambuca i have a little wood stir mix up the the coffee real nice whoops I just spilled a little no that's like gold and uh, you know in case you want to add a little cream you could use one of those you know powder powder creams or I just brought you know a tiny little bit of milk just pour it in there for whatever however you like to have your coffee and there we go man I mean how cool is that so now, after I do my knife reviews, I can enjoy a nice cup of coffee. Oh yeah, that's good. That's really good. All right, troops, man, that's the Out and Nano. Now look, I have an affiliate with these guys. Um, I will put uh, information in the links below. You could go check it out and get a little percentage off of this. And uh, I'm just real excited about this. I can't believe this worked on my first try. Fantastic. All right, Troops, Legionnaires, and new recruits, I hope you enjoyed this video. I think this out is pretty cool. Let me know what you all think in the comments below. I want to bring awareness to everybody. Hashtag 22 a day. Hashtag 22 a day no more. There are veterans and active military that once they get out of the service, they do face a lot of challenges. And unfortunately, one of these challenges is suicide. So at the end of this video, pause on the slides and seek the help you all have earned and deserved. All right, Troops, Legionnaires, new recruits, at the ready, hold the line, take care. Legionnaires!